Tell everybody happy Wednesday, happy June 5th, and happy Gay Pride Month. I will be seeing that all month until the month of June is over. Um, I want to say something to y'all. I appreciate everybody supporting me, and I appreciate everybody watching my videos. But I'm going to say this. I will not be reacting to Love and Marriage Huntsville until people start watching my videos more. If y'all hear that noise outside, that's somebody outside my door. Because right now, when I recorded Love and Marriage Huntsville on Sunday, I only got six views. And that's just not enough views for me to even keep participating on putting Love and Huntsville out there. And I, I was just thinking to myself, well, maybe I get tired of hearing about Love and Marriage Huntsville because they ain't nothing but a bunch of drama, which is true. So, uh, it'll be other things that I talk about, you know, but that won't be one of them. But coming to the, the board today, all across the board, now, I know y'all probably get tired of hearing about this person, but until it stopped coming through my DMs, I'm going to continue to talk about it. So, y'all, listen. When I'm about to tell y'all what shocked me may shock y'all too, unless y'all already seen it. So, Corey got another woman pregnant while married to Carmen. If y'all didn't hear me right, I'm finna say it again. Corey got another woman pregnant. Wow. Married to Carmen. Now, what the tea room said was this had to happen last year back in September because him and Carmen didn't break up until October. I told y'all, I sit here and I had told y'all that this, this man, he wasn't about nothing. I said that. I said that. On and on and on, I had said that. And I also said, Carmen do what she do. But in some ways, I kept feeling like, Um, Carmen should have not went back to him because now she looking like a whole fool out there in the streets. Um, look, I just think it's crazy. I just think it's crazy. And what I don't understand why? Why go through all that? What's the reason? Just why? That's the way I see about it. That's just the way I see about it. Why well, go through all of that and what's the reason? Because apparently this man don't care about your well-being. This man don't care about respecting you. This man don't even care about respecting his own kids. Y'all, I'm going to tell y'all something. He have another son out there, and it's Aiden. 
and that's by the first girl. Carmen used to help take her aid. Did Aiden mama like Carmen? I don't know. Because now you don't even see Aiden in none of the videos. Yeah. That means he don't be wanting them kids. That means just be doing it to get back at Carmen. But see, the thing is, he don't do it to um, Aiden's mom. He does it to Carmen. Because I say this, I don't really think, I think he know who to play with and who not to play with. And he know not to play with Aiden's mom. And then another thing is, I think he was in Atlanta for his birthday or something, and he was with a girl, a female, I ain't gonna say a girl, I'm sorry. And she was dark-skinned on how he be talking about dark-skinned women. But I don't even know why Corey talk about dark-skinned women, and this is the reason why I say this. I say this because Aiden's mom is dark-skinned. I think, to me, Corey just loves to keep a controversy. And whoever his this woman is that got pregnant by him. Everybody said they don't know how true it is. And this the tea room said they don't know how true it is or this cap. I don't think this cap. I think it's true. I don't think for a second that's his sister child because last time we seen his sister in a video, she wasn't pregnant. Unless he got more than one sister. I'm telling y'all. I believe that baby is his. Then his mama showed up. And the baby, he's a little boy. Y'all go on YouTube and, and, and see. Do I think Carmen care? No, I don't think she care anymore. I don't think she care. I think Carmen, some people feel like Carmen ain't done, done. She gonna keep going back to him and she's stupid. I'm gonna say this. I think she done. And he say he been on file for the boys and it's finalized. Okay, the day that you was talking about going down there and file for the boys was doing Memorial Weekend and you was going to do it that Monday, but that's on Memorial Day. I don't know no court open. And then he said when she was down there in Alabama, they was going to get a divorce and he took her to the courthouse and she said, no, nah, I don't want no divorce. We don't think that. I think, I'm going to tell y'all what I think. I think Corey wanted to work it out because Corey kept saying online, everybody seen it. He wanted his family back. I'm telling y'all, Corey's something else. You know, everybody want to say Carmen makes us look like a fool. Corey makes us look like a fool. He makes y'all look like a fool. He don't make me look like a fool because I see what I see straight through him and I see right through him. And if he did, I'm going to say allegedly, if he did allegedly, well, I ain't used to saying allegedly because it's already out there because he said that's his child. He said that himself. That was his child. I'm going to rewatch it again. And if he say, no, that's not his child, then I'm going to get back on here and tell y'all about it. But he said that he was his child. But I'm going to close this. And I just want to say happy Wednesday, everybody. And happy uh, God.
Gay Pride Month, which is Pride Month. This is Pride Month. And I just want to say happy June 5th. Love y'all.